ABC General Hospital spoilers tease that two highly anticipated returns and one unfortunate departure have shaken up General Hospital in recent weeks. The return of Jeannie Francis as Laura Collins and Jonathan Jackson as Lucky Spencer has thrilled fans as these key characters make their way back to Port Charles. Their reunion not only brings emotional moments, but also marks a significant turning point in ongoing storylines, particularly with Lucky being prepared to donate his liver to save his sister, Lulu. However, this joy is overshadowed by the confirmed departure of Kelly Monaco, who plays Sam McCall. Sam's exit has left fans heartbroken after years of following her character's journey. Although Sam has faced many trials with both Jason and Dante, Monaco's departure marks the end of an important chapter in her character's life. The two returns of Laura and Lucky bring new hopes, but Sam's exit leaves a significant void in the hearts of General Hospital's viewers. Laura and Lucas return to Port Charles with high hopes, especially with the expectation that Lucky will help save Lulu's life by donating his liver. However, real-life events do not align with these hopes. When final tests reveal that Lucky is not a compatible donor, a shadow falls over the entire family, pushing them into a deep emotional crisis. Laura's return, which should have brought hope and family reunion, is now filled with disappointment and the haunting reality of Lucky's inability to save Lulu. This failure not only leaves Lucky devastated, but also profoundly impacts everyone in the family, especially Laura. The strong mother, who has faced many trials in life, now finds herself watching helplessly as one of her children faces life-threatening danger without being able to do anything to help. The pressure on Laura intensifies as she juggles the critical condition of Lulu and the need to comfort and support Lucky, who is crumbling under the weight of failure and self-blame. Lucas, who also returns at this crucial moment, brings with him the family's hopes. He may act as emotional support for Laura and Lucky, but even Lucas cannot escape the haunting reality of Lulu's condition. Although he is usually calm and rational, the mounting tension leaves Lucas feeling powerless to solve the issue. Lucky's inability to help Lulu has left the entire family feeling increasingly desperate. The initial hopes seem to fade, and the fear of losing Lulu becomes stronger than ever. Everyone now stands at a tragic crossroads, where each family member must confront their own emotions. Laura, Lucas, and Lucky are all caught in a whirlwind of pain and anxiety with looming fears threatening to break their spirits. Will a miracle appear to save Lulu, or will this family have to face a loss greater than they could ever imagine? Laura is completely shocked when she learns that Cyrus has decided to sacrifice himself to save Lulu. This is an act no, no one expected from someone who has caused so much harm and danger to her family. However, the situation has become even more dire with Sidwell, a scheming enemy, poisoning Lulu. This puts Lulu in a life-or-death situation, and all hope for help seems to be fading. Despite his past as a cold-hearted and cruel man, Cyrus unexpectedly shows great determination to save his niece. Seeing Lulu's dangerous state after being poisoned, Cyrus realizes he has no choice but to step up. Laura cannot believe her eyes as she witnesses this transformation in Cyrus. A man who was once a major threat to her family is now willing to sacrifice himself to save Lulu. Sidwell's evil has thrust everyone into a devastating crisis, and not only Lulu but the entire family is caught in a storm of despair. Laura, always the strong mother, can only stand by, trapped between confusion and fear. She realizes there isn't much time left to save Lulu, and Cyrus's actions may be the last chance to save her daughter. However, will Cyrus's sacrifice be enough to counteract the poison Sidwell has inflicted on Lulu? The battle is not only against Cyrus's unexpected kindness, but also against a highly dangerous foe. The tension continues to rise as everything seems to spiral out of control, leaving Laura hoping for a miracle that Cyrus may be able to bring. The intense confrontation between Jason and Dante is pushing everything to a new level of chaos and madness, especially with Sam caught in the middle of all the trouble. The tension between the two men is not only rooted in their complicated past, but also in their worries about Sam's future. Jason, with his fierce protective instincts, can clearly sense the dangers approaching Sam. He has always been the one to face danger head-on to protect her. But this time, the situation is slipping out of control. 
The confrontation with Dante is not just a personal battle. It signals a larger crisis looming on the horizon. Dante, with his strong and determined nature, refuses to back down, but deep down, he harbors a quiet fear for Sam's safety. As both men are swept into the whirlwind of tension and schemes, Sam becomes the focal point of unavoidable dangers. The signs are becoming increasingly clear that Sam's death may be drawing near. Each encounter between Jason and Dante intensifies the pressure on both of them, heightening the uncertainty surrounding Sam's future. Despite her strength and resilience, Sam too senses the instability. She realizes that the people she loves are being caught in a web of tension, and death seems to be creeping closer by the day. The face-off between Jason and Dante is not just a struggle for pride, but a warning of the disaster approaching. This chaos and rising tension suggests that Sam's life is in grave danger and her fate seems inevitable. Will Jason and Dante be able to prevent this tragedy, or will they be powerless in the face of the inevitable? Sam's death is becoming a frightening reality, and everything is spiraling out of everyone's control.